Hey guys, Eamon here, back with another review video. Uh, sorry it's been so long since I've done one. It's, yeah, it's been like, man, it's been like a week or so, maybe, maybe more than that. Um, apologies. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna get back on, on schedule, uh, more regular uploads and all that. Um, but yeah, so I figured to start off with another, uh, another Springbok guy, because I know <laughs> a lot of you guys are big Springbok fans, so I figured we'd go for him, for, uh, for another one of them. Um, this one is, uh, Kobus, Kobus Rynak, Rynak? I, I looked it up uh, to get the pronunciation right this time. I think that's right. Co Cobus Rhin Rhinoch. Rhin yeah, something like that. Um, this was recommended. This is this was the guy that's recommended the most that I haven't done yet um, for South African guys. So it was recommended by Hank, Rob, Thando, and Silum Chazkane. Silum Chazkane? Yeah. But yeah, I'm pretty excited to check this guy out. Um, yeah, from... Looks like he... The name of the video I'm going to be doing is... Uh, it says lightning pace, so I'm gonna assume that means he's pretty fast. Um, I gotta look up his position and stuff though, so we'll do that. Yeah, yeah. If, if you are new here, we usually uh, we hop on Wikipedia first to look up the player's position and like stats, uh, all all that good stuff. So uh, we'll be doing that first. If, if you don't care about that, you can skip ahead. I got the time code set up for you to just go to the reaction to the uh, the video. Um, and yeah, if you enjoy, make sure to sub, make sure to like and comment what you take out in the future or anything I might have missed in the video. Um, yeah. All right, let's let's hop on Wikipedia first. Okay, Kobus. Kobus Reinach. Oh, it's, hey, Jacobus. Okay, Jacobus Meyer Reinach, 1990. Uh, South African player, plays for top 14 side Montpellier. And South African rugby team, yeah. He's a scrum half. Okay, scrum half is number nine, yeah. Link between the forwards and the backs, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we've definitely done some other scrum halves. Sorry, it's I always forget which number people are after I've done them. I gotta start putting them in the title. Um, okay, yeah. He's the son of former Springbok winner Yako Rynak. I believe this guy was recommended to me as well. So maybe I'll check him out after. Oh, he died super young. Age 35. Oh, it was a, a car accident? Damn. Damn, that sucks. Okay. He's a member of the Victoria Springer team who won the World Cup in 2019. Does that mean he's, he wasn't on the 2023 team? I guess we'll find out. Um, oh, he's 34. Okay, so he might he might have aged out uh, in rugby. Like he, I mean, that's not too old, but you never know. He, he might have been a bit too old for it. Um, yeah, 5'9", 187. So he's, he's a bit smaller, but... I think some of the scrum maps are not that big. Um, club career, yeah. I usually don't look at like the too much of the long stuff here, but um, okay. He never, okay, cool. He never represented the Springboks at any age group level until he was until he was 24. Okay, cool. October 2019, he scored a hat trick in a 66 to seven win over Canada at the World Cup 2019, the fastest rugby World Cup. Patrick ever okay that's <laughs> shout out Canada <laughs> okay no it says right here he, he won gold in 2033 as well okay I don't know why I didn't say the I didn't say that in the, in the yeah somebody who edited his Wikipedia to say that he he was on both teams yeah so he was on both okay test match record 16 and 5 with 13 tries okay that's pretty good International tries, got 13 international tries. Two in the world. We oh, had yeah, three against Romania. And three against, dude, he's got a couple. He's got two hat tricks in the, in the World Cup. I guess Canada and Romania probably aren't very top end teams, but still. Um, yeah, Tonga. Jeez, some huge blowouts here. Yeah, anyways, okay, his WP is not that long, but yeah, it looks like he's. Yeah, 32 apps, two gold medals. I'm assuming he's still playing for the team. Yeah, that assumes that. Maybe I can look that up. Let me look at his. All right. Yeah, let me know if there's a, a site that like shows their stats properly. Oh, here we go. This this is the site. I remember the site. Okay. Uh, what day is this? Okay, this is. Yeah. Do. So there hasn't been any international matches for a while. Yeah, the last ones were in like in the, the World Cup here. Yeah, it was like he didn't play in the finals. What does N mean here? Is that minutes played? What is that? Oh no, that's minutes. Okay, what is N? Oh, that's his number. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. That's his number. Okay, 
Yeah, he looks like he didn't dress for the for the for the finals. Did that mean he he got hurt or something potentially? Can I assume he got hurt? Um, or he just wasn't playing very well? I don't know. Anyways, that's that's enough Wikipedia. Let's just hop into the video. S sometimes the um, like yeah, I mean he is a, he's a big name player I guess, but yeah, he's not like one of the top top guys where their Wikipedia is like. 10 minutes long so we'll just we'll just hop in the video pretty quickly here we got another one from andrew ford um as usual he's one of the better uh rugby content guys so make sure to drop him a sub and like his video um this video the music is uh copyrighted so i'm gonna have to mute the music for this and replace it with my own music so uh apologies for that uh, it sucks that there's usually in these highlight reels there's a couple of moments where they have like commentary that's always fun to listen to but i'll have to, I'll have to remove that from the uh from the video, unfortunately. Oh uh, yeah, let's just hop into this. All right, Cobus Reinach tribute, lightning pace. There's Montpellier is, Reinach goes for a run around the fringes. Reinach puts a kick over for himself. Cobus Reinach! Yeah, this is against Canada, I think we should have had trick here. Change. He's more dangerous than co climate change, the commentator said. That's wild. See that coming. With the, Ooh, big tackle. Heavy hit. Oh, my kicker. Those are interesting jerseys. Holy. Nice, big tackle. Oh, what an interception. Yeah, he is gone. What the? How did he get so far away all of a sudden? Jeez. It looked pretty close, and then he would—they cut away for a second. Then he was just like thirty feet ahead. Oh, he's gone again. Or I guess yeah, he has lightning pace. Is what the video was said. So I guess he's really fast, obviously. Nice. The meerkat. <laughs> yeah. That the players called for a forward pass there. That looked like it was a forward pass to me, but I guess not. <laughs> Rynick. Nice. Ooh. Good pass, good pass. Well, kick play, nice. Another kick play, then he goes, yeah, nice. Jeez, look at those steps. Nice. Oh, was it charge down? Is that a charge down? Or is a charge down just when they kick it from us, from a, a penalty? Nice. There's another one versus Canada. Nope. We got it back. Those jerseys are like aggressively green. <laughs> Ooh, nice. He's making a lot of defensive plays in this. <laughs> nice. Oh, what a dummy. Nice. Oh, what a pickup. Holy. <laughs> Jeez. Just breaks through.
Oh, he stopped him. Jeez, I, th I thought he was on the white team there. Now he came back and stopped uh, a try. It's going to be the same thing? No, that's him scoring. Okay. So the video is pretty bad quality. I can't see some of the players. That's him there, right? Yeah. Yeah, you can tell he is just the way he runs and stuff, but he's a little stocky guy. Oh. Yeah, he looks like a bull. He just like runs through. Oh, was that when he stripped it? Or no, he picked it up there? Okay. Yeah, he's he's like, that guy just gave up. The guy that was right behind us completely gave up. He knew he was too fast. I guess the game was just about to end it as well. Nice. Jeez. Oh, little dummy. Oh, what a pass. This can be the hat trick goal or hat trick uh, try here. Yeah, here it is. Jeez. Canada just getting smoked. Mm -hmm. Oof. He's really good at getting to the middle too. He like he brings it to, to the middle for the the try touch. Jeez, oh, <laughs> he's bowling in the bowling in the try zone. Oh, what a yeah, what a grab. Nice. A little kick play. No kick play, nice little grab. Oh, nice. Oh, what a tackle. Yeah, I mean, he's just flying down the field. <laughs> Another one, jeez. He, like, carried him over. Nice. Yeah, I'll have a little kick to yourself, please. All right. All right, so that was my reaction to Kobus Reinach of the Springboks, uh, number number nine. Um, yeah, cool player to watch. Seems, yeah, he seems more of a, well, no, he scored, he scored a lot of tries. Yeah, he seems, he, he's good at, he's good at both things. Good, good at tackling, seems to make a lot of good reads, and then he, yeah, a lot of his tries seem to be, um, either like turnovers or he's like the second or third uh guy that gets up gets passed to is kind of the gist of what i what i saw there um i think that's pretty standard for his position though they kind of they kind of sneak in on the back a, a bit um but yeah no pretty exciting player um i'd be curious to know is his play winding down with his age like is he is he still a, like a top player or is he kind of slowing down with his age and i guess w would he be Nah, 2027. I don't know if he'd still make the team 2027 for the Springboks. Yeah. Yeah, pro probably not. He's probably, he'd be like, what, like 37 by then? Yeah, probably wouldn't make the team still. 
Maybe though. I feel like his position probably relies on a lot of speed though. So if he get, gets older, he might lose some of the, his his, uh, his speed, and that would be an issue. But yeah, no, really exciting player. I'm trying to think if he rem reminds me of anyone. Um, not off the top of my head. He just he just has like a bulldog energy to him. Like he just takes it and goes, runs through people. Um, for a small guy, especially, it's it's like pretty crazy. Um, yeah. Not a whole lot to say other than that. It's a good watch. Good watch. Let me know who else to should check out. Uh, like I've said, I have, a, I have a huge list of players to go through, but I, I am kind of getting to the point where there's, I've done like all the main players, so it's kind of tough to like pick pick people who I want to do next because it's yeah, there's not everyone has a highlight reel uploaded, and then yeah, it's yeah, it's a whole thing. Anyways, yeah, let, let me know that. Let me know if you have suggestions. Um, yeah, we'll get to them. Um, and yeah, for, for those of you that have been asking about um, uh, Chasing the Sun, yeah, I'm, I'm still figuring out how to get it uploaded for you guys. Um, yeah, I have a few things I'm going to try. I, I've been slacking with my YouTube in general the last couple of weeks, so that kind of went on pause after after I said I was going to get it uploaded soon. But yeah, I'm, I am going to figure out a way. We'll see how it turns out. But yeah, we'll, we'll, get, we'll get it uploaded soon. Um, I, I've watched the first episode amazing amazing show so i'm really excited to share my reaction um but yeah we'll, we'll see how that happens i'm hoping hoping by the end of the week i'll have a, a plan sorted out for that and uh i'll wait for you guys to watch it yeah anyways uh make sure to drop a sub drop a like comment if i missed anything about this player if you have any suggestions any um corrections i guess um yeah, just let me know. Let me know and I'll, I'll try to react to it. Um, yeah, have a good one, everyone.